Hey YouTube, on my way uh, into base camp, just thought I'd give you a little look around. Got some more snow, kind of warm today though. Got pretty, pretty warm out. It's uh, oh, probably 38 degrees out. But I'll bring you back when we get a little closer to camp. This is that area where I'm hauling the wood from. You can see I got a tarp over a whole pile of wood there. And then, uh, here's my, right here is, goes up and around that side of the wood pile is my trail. And that down tree had blown down and came all the way across here. And you can see where it was laying across over there, but it came all the way across and laid across this trail. So, I got that mostly cut up and out of my way. And out of the deal I got a nice pile of wood there. I just I got quite a ways to hoof it to camp. All right, we're starting to get closer to camp here on the trail. Let's see if I can get around this little corner here. I think you'll be able to see the camp. over here by this pine. The camp is uh, right over there. So I can zoom in. There you can see the the uh, heat reflector. It's up a pretty good hill, but we'll be there in a few minutes. Bring you back. Oh. Head up to the top. You can see a uh, bit of snow we got up here at camp. The Lavoo's still intact, standing proud. Need to clean the snow off, but. Uh, other than a little snow, it looks like camp's all in good shape. Be back in a bit. Oh, I'm back. I got most of uh, it shoveled back out again. Got the fire pit shoveled out. Got around the uh, Lavu shoveled out. As you can see, inside uh, it stayed perfectly dry inside the Lavu. I was really surprised because it had quite a bit of snow on it, but yeah, it did a good job. So we'll just go about, got to haul some more wood in. I put, had a bunch of wood in inside the Lavoo, as you can see, that's all dry. So I got a good good amount of dry wood to get things started. Um, going to start unpacking and getting things together and get this overnight going. Thanks. Be back in a bit. All right. I got the uh, tarp down on the inside to kind of uh, keep things a little cleaner from the dirt. I got a to-go bibby. Um, it's like made out of Tyvek. 
And then inside that, for tonight's sleep, I have my wool blanket. So that's all we're using tonight. It's only supposed to get down to about 28. So we'll have the uh, bivy and the wool blanket. We'll see how that goes. All right, I'll bring it back. I uh, got later than I anticipated, so gotta get a fire going here. I think we're gonna try the upside down fire again. Um, I don't know how well you'll be able to see this, but we'll give her a whirl. See if we can get this started here.
definitely not quite got enough there. Dark, can't hardly see what I'm doing myself. Well, almost. fatwood on there. See if that'll light. The birch is pretty wet. I guess this is why, why I carry a big lighter. Well guys, that looks like a fail attempt with the ferro rod there. Well, we got her going, but that's the first time I haven't been able to get fire going with a barrel rod. Guess that just goes to show you it's always good to have more than one means to start a fire. We'll let this get going a little bit. Put some coffee on. Maybe I'll bring you back then. Hey guys, I don't know how much you can actually see. I got my uh, headlamp up on the corner there, kind of pointing down to shine a little light. 
pitch black out, but coffee's done. Fire's going good. It's starting to burn down to the next next layer. Should burn quite a while. I'll probably get ready to hit the hay here in a couple more minutes and we'll see you in the morning. Y'all have a good night. Morning YouTube. So we had a pretty good night last night, slept all the way through the night. Uh, got down got down to about 31 degrees, so just a hair below freezing. It was about 35 degrees when I went to bed. The uh, to-go system bivy uh, really, really did a good job of uh, making that wool blanket ha have a little extra warmth. I actually had to unzip it at the first first part of the evening to uh, so I didn't get too warm. I was actually getting pretty warm. And then toward later on in the later on in the night I when I woke up I zipped it up and then went back to sleep. But yeah I did a really good job of keeping me warm. Uh, having our morning coffee and then uh, I think we'll pack up and start heading out. Thanks for stopping by.